Hello and welcome to my first how-to video. Uh, as you can see by the date of this journal entry, I'm just getting started. Uh, don't really know how to work the telescope that well, but I have figured out one thing that I want to share with you. Um, what I'm going to show you in this video is how to connect your camera to this port here. Uh, this port is the camera control port. Uh, what it allows you to do is program in uh, various locations in the sky and you can tell it to open your shutters your camera shutter you can tell it how long to expose for um, and you can set it to repeat or or you can set it to go to different objects in the sky um, I'm not going to go into that much uh, the the documentation on that that comes with the manual is actually pretty good but let me show you how to make this cable this port here uh, what you see is just a normal phone jack uh, this comes with the telescope. Uh, you get the phone jack on one end. On the other end, it looks like a headphones, but it's smaller than what you think of as a normal headphones. So that fits right in there. Um, so if you look at my camera, you also see a similar, what looks like a headphones receptacle there. So uh, it looks really like I just need a patch cable. Um, I go and get my PC patch cable. So if you can see this, this is a normal patch cable uh, that you would use perhaps to plug one end into your PC and another end into your PC speakers. Um, sometimes um, I'll use it to plug an iPod or an MP3, on one, MP3 player on one end and the other into a set of speakers or stereo system. This is a normal, normal size. Went to Radio Shack and I got this, which is, if you can see there, this is bigger than this. This is the adapter for that. Uh, I'll show you the package and I'll put some text detail in the journal entry, but this is a two and a half millimeter. That's a three and a half millimeter. So what you're looking for is a two and a half millimeter male to three and a half millimeter female. Here's what it looks like on the package. I don't know if you can read that. Um, I'll, again, I'll, I'll type up the details in the journal entry. But I got two of these, one for each end. One end fits nicely into there. The other fits nicely into my camera. Now I'm ready to put my camera right onto my uh, telescope. I take this and go to the camera menu. There's a camera wizard. I program in the exposures that I want. I hit enter. And it starts taking pictures for me. Thank you. I want to mention one thing before we go. Um, the adapter that I mentioned in the video is a little over three dollars so buying two of them um, give me you know seven eight dollars also just in case your camera is different uh, I'm using a Canon Rebel XTI so if you don't have that kind of a plug-in maybe maybe this procedure won't work for you but I hope it does